consider Carl Edwards and Tony Stewart. Both are poster boys for NASCAR excellence. Both are fan favorites, but for completely opposite reasons. In fact, you'd be hard pressed to find two more different drivers. Edwards has never won a cup title. And when he isn't charming fans with his smile, he's back flipping into the grandstands to personally thank them. Well, I saw the gate open there. I just want to go up there and be with the, be with the people. Stewart, meanwhile, carries the confident swagger of a two-time champion. There are no gimmicks, no agendas, and no apologies for a genuine bad boy image. Edwards is a fitness fanatic with a traveling personal trainer. A trainer, Dean. Stewart is the guy with a whopper in one hand and a cold one in the other. I've got a case of Schlitz that I fully <laughs> intend on getting to the bottom of the cardboard box tonight. Edwards relishes the media spotlight. Who's calling? That's my wife. That's a, it's a new sprint feature. You can see the person on TV when you're talking to him. Stewart has minimal tolerance for the circus. So ask me a question that's original this week. And if their personalities aren't different enough, their respective marches to the chase lead couldn't be more opposite. After limping into the playoffs, we're gonna run this bad. It really doesn't matter whether we make the chase or not. Stewart has charged to the front. Tony Stewart takes the checkered flag. Get it ripping off four chase victories. He better be worried, that's all I gotta say. Edwards, who held the points lead for most of the season, has been making a substantial something from a whole lot of nothings. He just got the lucky dog. They're back on the lead lap. I'm not going to down, downplay the gift that was given to me by God. In the end, no matter how different these two drivers may be, there is one quality they most certainly share. Both are to be the 2011 Sprint Cup champion, and they unquestionably have differing opinions on whom that should be. Yeah.